the drive Pierre Sol puts into his work, the ambition he has to carry his music not only to Zimbabwe but to the world, that's an ambition I can work with. It's not so easy, you know, because I've been doing this as well. I mean, this is probably, uh, this is like, I mean, it's my first time in Belgium, but this is my sixth time in Europe. Mm -hmm. I met a prayer soul 10 years ago when I first moved to Zimbabwe and I was driving the car through town trying to figure out my way and I got completely lost, stopped the car listening to the local radio station and that was the first time prayer soul was actually playing on radio. There's so much to appreciate and um, uh, I've, I've learned, I've learned so much within four weeks and they think they can just go on tour and become famous. But I always insist on understanding who the artist is. It looks very rosy on, on, on the outside, but there's so much, there's so much that goes into, so much sacrifice that goes into. not all jolly when you see the videos and all the social media hype and all the interviews we're giving. It looks very powerful and it is very powerful, but it's also a lot of work behind the scenes. Because I think touring also opens you up to, to understanding different parts of a country and uh, different cultures and behaviors. <laughs> No, no.